It was dilapidated, collapsed. Metropolis is an Art Deco sculpture. Driving around in a car like this is good fun. I'm 98% certain that this was probably built under duress. Dorset, in the southwest of England, is home to a stunning vehicle with a dark past. When Germany occupied France, they loved Peugeot and they kept Peugeot going. Apparently officers of the German army, and they would rule unusual vehicles for toys for themselves and the workers of Peugeot would be made to build this car. It's a product of that period. It's a history that took place and we can't rewrite it. If something came creative out of it, it's quite astounding. After being neglected and left to rust for almost 70 years, Andy bought the Peugeot in an online auction and had it shipped over from France. It was dilapidated, just collapsed. He then set about transforming this World War II relic into an Art Deco inspired masterpiece. The truck was so rusty that just everything was disposed of and I just kept the panels that I needed. It had a flat screen originally and it had a really ugly roof line. The roof line went up like the new transit shape. That has been chopped. I've lengthened the back, I've shortened the tail. And it's not just Peugeot parts that complete this incredible conversion. The chassis is Ford Ranger. The seats are Jaguar, Jaguar buckets. The steering wheel is very early Porsche. The front wings are 1937 SS Jaguar, the French 1930s side lights. The dashboard is the original Speedo and painted in two-tone to match the seats. Peugeot Lion original mascot. The bonnet and the grille used to be one piece and I've separated that. Original Art Deco hotel door pulls. The only original part of the car which hasn't been touched in any way whatsoever are the headlights. Completed with an amazing paint job and named Metropolis, Andy's creation certainly turns heads when it hits the road. When you drive this, people don't know what it is. I've now bought 58 cars, just hopscotches across every genre of unusual vehicles. With so many builds under his belt, it's no surprise that Andy's already on to his next project. I've just started this French style two-seater, huge roadster, which is all fenders with no tires on display. Driving around in a car like this is just, it's good fun. Metropolis is an Art Deco sculpture. I would love this to go to a museum. <laughs>